and welcome to another episode of Sea of Thieves News. We take a sneak peek at an update to rowboats, get the lowdown on the upcoming community weekend, and we're showcasing some incredible cosmetics to celebrate the release of the third and final tale of the legend of Monkey Island. Our next community weekend is on the horizon, and it's not long to wait. From September 30th to October 2nd, the Season 9 Community Weekend will offer a host of tantalising rewards for you to dig your hooks into. A glorious picture wall will be available at every outpost, so you and your crew can get some sweet selfies and reminisce about your epic adventures. And once again, Community Weekend will offer players the chance to influence the Community Emissary Grade, resulting in boosts to gold, reputation, renown and allegiance over the course of the event. And there are also login bonuses for all players, with the Season 9 Community Weekend flag and as a reminder of the world beyond the Sea of Thieves, the Touch Grass Emote. Across our Affiliate Alliance communities, groups and projects run by fans and players all over the world, you'll often find new creations to enjoy and community-run events to get involved in. Sea of Thieves Brazil are in the middle of their own mystery. Tides of Secrets attempts to unravel communication between the Reapers and the Siren Queen and is running until November 24th and Sea of Thieves France are releasing their next short film. Following on from their Port Nowhere series, their latest film, Jade, Stars of Mischief, tells a story of friendship, mysteries and dangers. You can find out more about our global affiliated communities at the link below. In case you missed it, we recently released the Pulse Racing Skeleton Ambush. This track joins the ever-expanding Sea of Thieves soundtrack, all of which is available to listen to on your favourite streaming services. There are two things in life that I'm pretty sure are universally accepted to be true. One, bandanas make you look cool. And two, you can never have too many of them. And in our next update, you can visit your nearest outpost store where there's an expanded variety of colours to choose from. Fit for any occasion. And bandanas aren't the only thing arriving in new colours. We're over to Marcin and Dom to tell us more. In season 10, you'll be able to find some new colorful robots on the shores of islands that you visit. We still have the classic look, um, so that's not going anywhere, but now some robots that you find will not be the same and they'll have some more character. We have a number of different colors available in different varieties and different rarities, but the rarest of them is the good boy, which is obviously quite rare and obviously the goodest of robots. Also, if you're a captain, you can save the rowboat that you have found and attached to your ship as part of your ship loadout, which means the next time when you come back into the game, you will have the rowboat that you found. If you think for any reason at all, that rowboat will stay behind for the person probably responsible for that. These new colourful rowboats and the ability to save them to your ship will be one of the many new features to arrive in Season 10, which launches on October 19th. And soon we'll be bringing new items to the Pirate Emporium. With the Pocket Serpent emote, these slithering serpents are sure to charm their way into your hearts. And while their actions might seem scary and potentially fatal, that just means they like you. And prepare to wow even the most po-faced pirates with the masterful magic of the Lucky Deal emote. Yours for free. And finally, to celebrate the third tall tale of the legend of Monkey Island, we've got even more special items headed to the Pirate Emporium. Incredible cosmetics will be available alongside the final tall tale of the legend of Monkey Island, the Lair of LeChuck. This tale will see players travel to Monkey Island alongside Guybrush Threepwood, exploring through dense jungle and lava-filled catacombs 
as they race to put an end to LeChuck's latest master plan. The Lair of LeChuck will be available for free for all players from September 28th. And that's it for another episode. To stay up to date with everything Sea of Thieves, then make sure to like, subscribe, and ring that little ship's bell, and we'll see you on the seas. Cheers.